I got a few new things for spring and I want to show you guys. I've been making it a point to get more statement pieces, but I also want to show you how I'm updating my wardrobe with Elevated Basics. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Ashley Park. This is Park Avenue and I have tons of fashion content. So if that's what you love, subscribe and hit those notification bells because now's not the time to miss a thing. I have lots more spring fashion content coming up and I don't want you to miss it. So I have been doing a lot of spring shopping and I'm going to be doing more, but the pieces that I have been picking up have been more like statement pieces, standout pieces, colorful, things like that. But I do want to still pay attention to my basics and I need to make sure that I'm upgrading my basics that I have and, you know, rotating them and bringing in new basics that I need because obviously that's the way you build a really great wardrobe and you can really style them over and over again. And then you style the basics with the standout pieces and that way you can easily build outfits. So I want to show you guys what I picked up, starting off with some pieces that I got from Nordstrom. Now these pieces were gifted, but I was able to pick out what I wanted. And first off, I want to talk about this cropped top. Now I picked out this one because so many of you asked me about a top that I had a while back. I styled this like cream color crop top with um, like a skirt, like a high-waisted uh, strapless dress under it. So it looks kind of like a goddessy vibe. And so when I saw this top, I was like, this is almost the exact same top. It's just that this one is black. And then it also comes in like a green sage sort of a color. So definitely check this one out if you've been wanting to recreate that look or if you're just looking for this top in general because it does not come around often. I love the cut of this, it's super flattering and it's very forgiving. So if you're someone who wants to show a little bit of midriff but you're kind of unsure about that, the flowiness and billowiness of this top lets you be able to do that easily. So I really love this, highly recommend it. And it has a little bit of a shoulder pad, offers some structure and some nice balancing. I really like a little bit of a shoulder statement kind of a piece because if you're a curvy girl, it balances those hips out. And then of course the smallest part of you is looks like your waist. It, whether it is or it isn't, it's gonna give that appearance. So I really like that about it. Next up, this shirt dress. I love shirt dresses because they're so versatile. I can wear them as dresses, but I can also wear them as shirts with shorts underneath. I can wear them over bathing suits. I mean, they have like so many options. What I love them the most for is like a throw on and go kind of an outfit. We are always looking for things that we can just throw on and go out the door. And a shirt dress is really perfect for that. This one comes in black like I'm showing you here, but it also comes in white, which is a great option because a nice crisp white shirt really goes with everything. And of course, as we're getting through the spring and into the summer, a nice crisp white shirt is going to take you far. You can really style it and restyle it over and over again. So that's a really great option if you're looking for something like this. The cut of this is really, really nice. It fits kind of slim through the top and then goes away from the body toward the bottom. A really flattering cut. Next up, I've been looking into more dresses that are like tank style. Again, a throw and go kind of an item. And this dress was great because I liked that it was that basic style that I was looking for, but it also had an interesting shoulder detail. It has like a double strap, which is a really nice feature because otherwise it would just be like a plain tank dress, which is fine as well. But I like when my basics have a little bit of an elevation. So this is really great for casual dressing. I love just throwing these on when I need to run errands, run around town, but you can throw a heel on and some cute jewelry, some really great accessories, and then you have a going out outfit. So I love these kinds of dresses for that. Next up, I wanna share a couple of pieces that I got from Koss. And Koss is a very like minimalist, a lot of like clean lines. It's very like simple dressing but in a very attractive way. I look at the website often, but this is my first time actually purchasing anything, and I'm really happy that I got these two items. First up, I wanna talk about this cropped button up top. I love the cut of this top. Now, when I went into the store, I actually saw it on one of the salespeople in white, the woman who I initially saw when I walked in, she was wearing the white version of this top, and I was like, oh my gosh, I love your top. And she was like, oh, I have one more. And it happened to be in a size 10. I was like, let me just try it, because usually I would size up in a button up shirt, especially a cropped button up shirt. So I was like, oh, I probably need a 12. But when I tried it on, the 10 fit me perfectly. I just loved it. I love the cut of this because I have some other cropped button up shirts that I really like, but this one wasn't as boxy as the ones that I have. And it was more so, it gave me like a vibe of a very, very high end crop button up shirt. Like I just really loved it. And the white one that they had was the last one. And there was like a little bit of a ring on the collar. So I didn't get the white one. I'm hoping that they restock it, but I made sure to get this blue one. This is a very dark navy, 
gorgeous. I love this. And I like that it's not black and it's a, an alternative to just like a white button up. And I really love that about it. I can still wear it with a lot of things, but it is a color that's going to live long in my wardrobe and be very versatile. So I just love this. I think you guys should definitely check it out. I love the way it looks with just like high-waisted jeans, but I also love the way it's going to look with like shorts in the summertime. I just think this is a really great top to have, and I hope they bring it back in the white. And if they come out with it in black, I'm going to get it too. <laughs> and while I was in the store, there was a woman in the fitting room who was trying on like this cropped beige jacket. It was so cute. I love the lines on it and it had like a cargo pocket in the front. I'm going to link it for you guys so you can check it out. And they also have this dress. If you are, I didn't try it on, so I'm not sure if it's going to work for a curvy body or if it's more for a slim figure, but it was really cute and definitely worth, worth looking into if you're interested. And it gave me a Prada vibe. It looked just like a dress that I saw from Prada. It comes in green and it also comes in black. Definitely check it out. I'm going to link them in the description box so you guys can see what I'm saying, but I love it. Now moving on to the next piece that I picked up and it is this knit cropped jacket. I'm obsessed with this. I absolutely love it. When I put it on, I was like instantly. First of all, when I saw it on the hanger, I was like, oh, this is so cute because it has a double zipper. I was like, this is going to be so cute because I can unzip the bottom. I love a cropped jacket. I love a cropped anything really. And I love the sleeves on it because they kind of like belled out. And this is another piece that I wasn't sure about sizing because I thought I wanted to size down, but I really love the length of the sleeves and, the, and it bells out a little bit. So I'm going to list all my size information in the description box, every size that I got in each of the items that I'm showing you guys so you can have it for reference. But I love this jacket so much. It's going to pair so well with just my tank tops. I'm going to wear it as a top. I'm going to wear it for travel. I'm just going to keep it as like a topper to throw over my shoulders when it gets chilly in the summer months when I'm like in AC. It's just a really Really nice knit I love the weight of it and the fabric that it's made of is like it's that cool kind of fabric like it's not gonna get hot in the summertime so I really like it so cute I love that double zip I love that it's silver I love the collar on this knit it's just like a little bit longer slightly oversized gorgeous all around really great and I would recommend sticking to your normal size or sizing up if you can because I really love the length of the sleeves and the way that it bells out a little bit and I just unzip the bottom just like kind of like a 90s vibe like zipped it down low and then zipped it up a little bit so it's kind of just peeking showing a little bit of belly but you can zip it all the way down if that makes you feel more comfortable I love it and it also comes in a white on the website and I think it's like online only so if you guys are interested definitely check out the website next up I'm going to show you a few things that I got from Urban Outfitters now if you saw my last haul then you saw that I have been having a moment with bucket hats and it's not just a moment I've always loved bucket hats but just like right now I'm finding all these cute ones that I want and I have to have so I saw these on Urban Outfitters and initially I just saw this one and right away it reminded me of the denim Gucci bucket hat with like the leather trim around it. And I was like, oh, this is so cute. And it's patchwork. I've been obsessed with patchwork. So I'm like, I have to try this one out. And then when I was looking into it, I saw that it also came in this one. So I was like, I have to get these. I'm going to show you on the model because I have a ponytail, so I'm not going to be able to put it on properly. But these are so cute. They're extra dramatic. They're so fun. And depending on how you position them, you can wear them like for like everyday wear. But they are pretty dramatic. Like the part that hangs down is pretty dramatic. So I'm going to wear these mostly for like by the pool, at the beach, taking on vacation, when I'm sunbathing. Just to give me that, you know, coverage from the sun. But like this one with like any colorful bikinis. And this one with like a black bikini, my sarong, some flip flops, a tote bag. I'm good to go. These are so cute. I'm obsessed with them. I just love them. I think they're such great quality. And the prices were really good on these. Honestly, I thought this was going to be like... 60 or 80 bucks and it wasn't so definitely check these out if you're interested and if you're looking for something like an alternative to like a straw hat um to wear for like the beach or the pool or your everyday life this is so cute i picked up one more bucket hat from urban outfitters and it's this white denim one i love this so much now this one is more wearable for everyday because even though it does have a wide brim it's not so wide that it's going to flop down too far so you can still wear this for every day but it's still another great option for the pool the beach and all that sunbathing but I love that this one has the frayed hem and it also has a wire in the hem so that way you can mold it so it can sit how you want it to sit so I really like that I think this is so cute very fresh and just like bright and clean I love this 
Now here is the last item that I wanna show you guys, and it is my very first orange box. <laughs> this is my first Hermes purchase, and I really love these. So I had been looking for this item for a while. I didn't know where I was gonna find it, like what brand I was gonna go with, but I couldn't find exactly what I was looking for. And I ended up with these Oran sandals, which I am now obsessed with, and I do want other colors. I see why people collect them. But I was looking for a pair of white sandals, and I was having a hard time finding that. So when I saw that these were crisp white, I was like, let me just at least try them on so I can know if this is what I want or not. And when I tried them on, they were perfect. They're very comfortable. I have heard mixed reviews about these, but mine, these are very comfortable. They fit on my foot nicely. The leather is soft. And I know that the colors are different leathers, but the white ones, the leather is really comfortable. And I just really like these. So highly recommend them. If you guys have been thinking about them, I think they're so worth it. Um, the soles, I'm going to get rubber soles put on the bottom. Normally I would do it right away, but we are in sandal weather right now. So I'm torn. Am I going to just wear them right away? Or am I going to take them to get rubber soles? But anyway, I love these. I think they're so great and I see why people collect them. So I probably will be getting another color, but just like, look how good like this looks like with my bathing suit in between, or just like shorts and a tank top, this hat, these sandals, like really clean and fresh and fun. I really love that. So that's what I will be doing. And I love wearing tank tops and shorts and flip flops in the summer. And this is a really great way to elevate a basic sandal. So I love these. And while I was at the Hermes store, when I was checking out, I was smelling the fragrances and they had one at the register called age 24. It smelled so good. It had like a powdery smell and apparently it's a men's fragrance, but I don't care. I've been really into men's fragrances lately. Um, you guys know I've been wearing Winston's Zerjoff. I really like that one. And so I've been mixing it with my fragrance, wearing it. I love it. And so they gave me a couple samples. They put it in this cute little container. I really love this nice little mini MS bag, but I cannot wait to try these out, these samples and see how it mixes with my chemistry because it smells so good. I hope it mixes well with me. So I'll go ahead and get that one. So I think that'll be like my next fragrance purchase. We'll see how goes let me know if you guys have tried it i'll have everything linked in the description box so you guys can check it out let me know if you have any questions in the comments let me know if you're going to be picking up any of the items that i shared if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to give it a thumbs up and if you want to catch me on some of my other platforms like instagram pinterest tiktok i will have all those links in the description box as well i'll catch you guys in the next video Bye.